Let me introduce myself. My name is Alex Kashin. I'm co-founder and CEO of an energy group, a leading Russian electrochemical company. We are creating sophisticated network and ecosystem for renewables and let me say new energy. And we do believe that in this new energy era, electrochemical technology will play a significant role. And actually it's all about ways how to produce energy in an efficient way, how to store energy and how to convert fine chemicals from uh, hydrogen uphill to hydrocarbons and spirits and downhill from uh, different thin fuels down to hydrogen and CO oxide dioxide. Actually, that's new energy we can divide into three basic divisions. The first one is energy generation. It's mainly about fuel cell. And fuel cell is a device to directly convert a chemical uh, energy of fuel into electricity and heat with high efficiency. And the second uh, direction is storage. And actually, we can divide metal ion storage, such as you know, uh, acid or lithium ion batteries, and a flow batteries where we can uh, store energy and generate power independently. And the third part is uh, catalysis and fuel. Actually, it's all about the hydrogen energy and we can produce uh, via electrolysis uh, hydrogen out of water uh, with energy taken from renewables or we can um, extract hydrogen out of hydrocarbons. So this new industry is in the beginning of the way and we think that educational and seminar for such a stuff is a quite important thing. And our portfolio includes all examples of this uh, new energy uh, stuff. We have here a couple of examples for uh, new energy and seminar equipment and just for instance we can uh, study a way how we convert hydrogen into electricity and heat and with such a panel a hydrogen energy we can actually measure a temperature, humidity, IO curve and other stuff that's uh, quite important to understand the overall process from scientific and engineering point of view. Uh, this um, redox flow battery in a compact design uh, we can actually study uh, a vanadium redox flow battery a new way to store energy on a utility scale level and from uh, this side you can see a thermoelectric we call it Peltier Zbeck effect it's actually a way how to get energy uh, between two uh, conductors with different temperature uh, we can create electricity out of this difference between low temperature and high temperature or we can actually cool down or heat up this conductor via electricity. And also, uh, most important in my opinion, um, the part of renewables is the solar uh, energy and we have also here a set to study different solar panels, you know, we have now variety of technologies such as the different thin films etc and they actually um, allows us to uh, use this uh, specific type of solar uh, due to uh, conditions we have uh, because of temperature range and other stuff. Also we have a couple of examples for a mobility application and just for instance this set for robotechnic platform where we can install a hydrogen fuel cell and a hydrogen storage such as a metal hydrate alloys allows us to store uh, hydrogen in a um, safe and efficient way. So, and also we provide a curriculum for such uh, equipment and actually we combine a physical chemistry into um, big play with uh, high-tech and um, educational things. Actually, our aim is to create you know, a scientific engineering atmosphere and to make science engaging and to involve uh, children and adults.
falls into this high-tech uh, technological game and actually we are trying to explain uh, to our clients the importance of this renewable and green energy and hydrogen energy and actually we plan to develop much more product on that basis not only for stationary but for automotive and for a deep science application and more professional level as well actually we name it as technological trajectories and we try to bring uh, a holistic approach between a scientific understanding and the future market and to bring together uh, these uh, things and to find a unique way for a specific group of students to find themselves into this, um, let me say, energy future. Thank you.